Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. I'm Ultima Man Toy. Oh my god, how many new sp men? Oh my god. Uh, we're gonna take care of the Mad Duck first. And since they're all in the back, we're gonna go ahead and hit the back row with Fire Beta. I realize it's expensive, but I don't care. Um, what else? Anything he can use? Slime Generator. Yeah, that'll work. Something sticky stuck to the enemy. Newsman C was solidified. Cool, we removed... No! No! You stupid duck! You stupid duck! Okay, so I take back what I said about Newsman not being dangerous. Might as well head and go for beta on this one. I'll just HP sucker C, because it can't move. And Jeff can't do anything either, so it didn't matter. Hang in there, Paula. Sucker. That was a lot of those guys. <laughs> Jeff just can't do anything right now. At least he got his turn in this time. We'll take care of the other noose man in the meantime. Man, that was a lot of them. And then kick him while he's still wrapped up in your rope. Okay, that was that was a pretty I should have super bombed there and saved the PP, but Carton of Cream. Uh now if I only had the food. Does anybody actually have food still? I'll hand it over to uh, Paula. So we're gonna go this way. Hey! Please take my son along. He may look like a regular small mouse, but he can lead you to an exit if you're lost in a maze. Didn't you leave my son with someone? What? Man, I just realized what I did. Croissant. Ooh, yes, yes, yes. Need to toss a bomb. What's in here? Picnic lunch. Alright. Um, so we could use the exit mouse, except I don't have the exit mouse. What's down here? A bomb inside. Okay. So we got another bomb. Oh, good, it's a snake for once. We'll just toss the bomb, so that way I can get the food onto Paula. Yeah, we'll just shoot. Good job! Whoa, not bad. Good job, Jeff. No, not the poison. Okay, this is ending now, one way or another. Wow, that is severely weak to f freeze. 
that's like insanely weak to freeze. Alright, so we'll trade the croissant and we'll give it over to Paula. Now we will give the contact lens. No, 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 no. We'll give the sudden guts pill over there. Wait, yeah, poison, that's right. Now, you're gonna eat that croissant, and you're gonna like it. Oh my dear sweet freaking merciful god, that is a lot. We need to kill the ducks ASAP because they like to suck away the uh, PP that Nez has. Yeah, these are the same Mad Ducks from Winters. When we met Jeff. Wow, she hits that thing hard. Oh, come on. Fucking heal her already, Ness. And, yeah, Jeff, Jeff, you're breaking in that HP sucker really well. Because, uh, like, <laughs> yeah, if you keep doing that, you can actually kind of indefinitely tank these guys while Ness and Paula just beat the shit out of everybody else. And one more time, go ahead and see if we can't top your HP off before it dies. Oh, never mind. Too late. Thirty-five. Nice. I need another, uh... There has to be another, uh, caramel. We saw one. Use on this. There has to be another one. I know we had another one. Or maybe that was... There it is. Paula has it. Yep, see watch. Their experience will be like crap. Yeah. Oh my god, wave after wave of these guys. I'm gonna have to fire that front row. There's no way I can do this without firing at the front row. Um Wait, hang on. Yeah, just bash the noose man. And fire on the front row. And HP sucker. Do not want those ducks doing anything. Because they may have no HP, but the fact that they can sit there and just can constantly roll your, your psychic points to nothing. And then keep you from using, you know, your, your spells. That's, that's kind of dangerous. So many noose men! Good god! Ducks and noose men. That's what this dungeon is. Ducks and noose men. And here's number four. I am truly the third strongest master of this hole. I'll demonstrate the power of being third to you. Alright. This, I'm going to try and make this as brief as I can. Flash. Let's go for a freeze. Gamma. I forgot to look that up, by the way. Goods, um... Yeah, I guess we'll just, uh, shoot at him. <laughs> That's what I was afraid of. Please, 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 God, please, God, no. Just, Jeff, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it, kill it, please. Do something. Nope, Paula's gone. <sighs> Not cool. But you know what? We do have a couple life noodles. Why'd you use the bad key machine, you dumbass?
Why did I use? Fuck. A couple left it was on Paula. Oh good, he's dead. He's just he's fucking dead. Okay, that works. I'll just bring Paula back like now. Jeff is thirty two. HP went up by twenty five. Awesome. Good timing, Jeff. Use on Paula. Luck capsule. And platinum band. Now that is something really, really useful. Platinum band, where was it? Oh, what was the platinum band? Oh, it's over here. Durr. Yeah, look at that. Considering Paula is basically the DPS machine, she needs to stay alive. And what else? Do we have a luck capsule? Who needs luck? 33, 31, 25. There it is. Ness has homesick. Okay, we're going to get to actually see what this does. Uh, let's give the luck capsule to... We'll use it on... Who's it on this? Why not? Don't want to fight the ducks. We got four of these things gone. Oh my god. That's four of them. bomb inside. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of the Thirsty Coil Snake because I don't want him poisoning. Actually, I wonder. I want to try Magnet Omega. And just because I'm not seeming to get anywhere I'm going to go ahead and fire a bottle rocket at the Thirsty Coil Snake. Because they don't seem to work on the moles, so why not? I can buy more. Really should have used the HP sucker now that I think about it. Nice, nice hit, Ness. That's what I didn't want happening. So yeah, this is the third episode being recorded in a row. So yeah, I hope that this is gonna. I hope this turns out to be like a good one. I just need like one more psychic point. Ness needs to freaking level. Oh my god, he killed it with the HP sucker. That's cool. And then we left a present. A chick! We got a friggin' chick. How did that... I, you know what? Whatever. We have a chick. We just made like a hundred and something dollars. Now these guys are a pain, and I'm gonna try and take them out immediately. Okay, so A is gone. Okay, that's fine. Ness already got his turn, and Paula can freeze that one too, so... No, no, not pray. Actually, what happens if I pray? Maybe I'll get lucky with some psychic uh, points. Maybe we'll get some lucky with some PP. Good job, Jeff. Oh, well, at least you dodged. I'm 
this is going to be an interesting last uh, stretch here. <sighs> of course. No, 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 no. Give the caramel to... Yeah. Oh my god! At least it didn't poison me. Nah, that's a good thing. What if it poisoned me? That'd been pretty brutal. Well, at least I got some psychic points out of it. Alright, so here we are. The the home stretch here. Gotta find that last ant before I run out of resources. Because I have seriously used a lot of resources. There he is! Number five! <laughs> you fought the strongest master of this hole. The second strongest master of this hole. The fourth strongest master of this hole. And the weakest master of this hole. I'm truly the third strongest master of this hole. Now you see the true advantage of being third. What advantage? You're just like everybody else. You're not special. Um... I'm not gonna flash this time. I need to conserve the psychic points. I will, however, go for the Omega. And we'll actually just shoot. 385. That's a lot of damage. Oh my god! And he, he's done! Thank god! Paul is almost out of psychic points here! Office won it by three. Not bad. Mmm, yes! Let's open the present. There's a Guts capsule inside. Who actually needs the Guts? Guts is important to everyone. Ooh, Paula or Jeff? We'll give it to Paula. How do you drink a capsule? Well, actually, I, I just thought about that. You can, actually. A secret herb inside. That would have been useful to have. Notice that now all five moles are gone. This dungeon is empty. Ooh, do I get to come along, too? Yeah, this is where you can pick up... Uh, if you use your, uh, your mouse or whatever to go through wherever you go. Oh, I know how to get out. You know, this is the first time I have done this entire dungeon without ever once going up to the surface and having to heal and rest. I am proud of myself right now. I feel like I'm on top of the world. But not really. And that would be the chicken. No. No. Look, buddy. I just got out from a cave thing under the sand. I, fuck you. Fuck you. I want to go take a shower, get this sand off me, you know, go... Just, yeah. Look at you. Too fucking good to just stand on the fucking sand be all like... Oh, I'm gonna fly around everywhere because I take pictures of everybody. Tease. That butterfly is a friggin' tease. Oh my god, it took all three PSI caramels, but I got through it. Working through the knife... Ni working through the knife. Yes, working through the knife. Jeff fixed the broken pipe. After being fixed, the broken pipe became the shield... The shield killer. I think in the last part, or the part before, didn't I say something about uh, the shield killer? And how I really wish I had it? <sighs> Help. Shield killer. Items for Jeff. Breaks through the enemy's shield during a battle. Can be used many times. 
I hate this game. Um, Homesick hasn't done anything yet, so we're not calling Mom yet. We will call Dad. Whoa! Yeah, you deposited like $16,000 there, Dad. It was like more than half of what I just got. Uh, just save, please. I can't remember what the contact lens is for. Alright, well, that's done. Let's talk to him. You've gotten rid of the monster? Good job. Okay, from here on, just let me dig. You'll see. I'll find the buried gold. Before I start digging, I'm going to set a careful plan of action. I think you have to sleep here again. So I'll just do it anyway. Maybe Jeff will fix something else. Nope. Yeah, he's gone now. Maybe he went back inside. Of course he did. He's a digger. He's like those people from Minecraft. Well, where'd he go? He's like gone completely. Ah, eh, he's probably digging something. I'll look around a little bit, see if he just he's gone. And then I'll talk to those people and we'll go back to Forest Side. Nope, he's not in here. I can't believe I did that. I've been watching them dig for a while. I wonder what they'll find. Nothing. Nothing for you. What was that noise? I'm getting random fucking sound effects in my game now, in my playthrough. This is not cool. Alright, well. Let's head back to Foresight and sell this chicken! Because it's gonna cluck all day! What the hell? It's a backhoe! Ness, greetings! I'm George, Gerardo Montague's brother. Gerardo is in his mine, but he hasn't found any buried treasure yet. We did, however, find a diamond instead. Ooh, a diamond. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. I'll just give it to Paula. Gerardo, Gerardo told me to give it to, give it to Ness. Here it is. Please take it. Jeff got the diamond. Well, I've got to go. I'm busy working at the other mine. Busy, busy, busy. Take it easy, George. Thank you. I do have one... One question. How did that thing go faster than us? We were out walking it. I'll give it to Paula. So what does it say? A big, beautiful, and expensive-looking gem. Hmm. I wonder if we could sell that thing. I wonder how much it'd go for. It's a diamond. Diamonds are... It's a big diamond, meaning that it's going to be worth quite a bit. Well, I'm sure it could be worth like a million dollars or something. dollars huh I think we need to pay somebody a visit fuck you yes I'll buy the ticket again I don't care about the show. I'm going to talk to your boss. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. Yes. What? Excuse me? No, no. Let's see. 
Hey, you guys. Hey, you guys. Oh, but the joke's on you. Let's use that diamond on you and see what happens. What, what, what? I can't tell what it is from this distance. Bring it closer. Are you that blind? Or do you have your eyes shut? Yay! That, that, that diamond! You're gonna pay with that diamond? Oh, oh, oh okay. That, that's fine. I'll rip up this contract. Don't tell me... Don't tell anyone about the diamond. Now, the Runaway Five are free. You should thank me. That diamond is worth maybe, maybe, fifty dollars. So I gave you a bargain. Dum, 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 dum. I made lots of money. And that would be the sound of their contracts. Sorry about being such troublemakers. We won't be so gullible anymore. Well, our fans are waiting, baby. Let's do this, do this one last show, and then get out of here. Alright, thanks again. Money, that's what I want. Money, that's what is hot. Money, that's what I want. Money, it's what we ain't got, except freedom. Freedom. Freedom is what we've really sought. Money, that's what I want. Money, that's what is hot. Money, that's what I want. Hey, hey look, yo! Yeah. And the chicken clucks. And we will watch the Runaway 5 one last time. Welcome to the final... Uh, let's see. Welcome to the final Runaway 5 performance at the Topola Theater. You up front. Shh. Sit down. It's gonna be a great show. We're so good, it makes me think that those kids by the exit will wet their pants. Those kids are hip, baby. lady, whoever she is. Huh. Well, that was a strange performance. They just got in the van and left and danced. Are they back here still? Yes, I am a friend of the Runaway Five. Miss Venus? That must be Venus up there. Oh, you're just a little kid. I'm too busy right now to give you my autograph. Maybe next time, little man. Nope, nothing in there. Yeah, you better move. We just saved the Runaway 5 again. That's cool. That's cool. Alright, so, how's everybody's health? Hold up. Uh, I think we'll go rest at the end. And then we'll go shopping. Actually, I think we're almost done with this episode. So I'll rest at the end and then uh, we'll call it a video. Yes, sir. Are you staying here tonight? 
thanks for being so generous with your tips. You never gave me a tip? Never mind. Welcome to the Monotoli Grand Hotel. A one-night stay will cost you 225 Yes, actually, I will stay. Good morning! This is a unique service exclusive to our hotel only. Then why did all the other hotels do this? I'm here to read you today's headline on the front page of the Foresight Post. Over 70% of uh, Foresight citizens support Monotoli. This city's corrupt, dude. They, they're buying a hook, line, and sinker. Hey, you. If you meet a beautiful, seductive woman who's looking for me, tell her hi. Anyway, I don't think a woman like that would be looking for me. Story of my life, bro. Yes, chicken, I hear you. Alright. So we'll call Dad, we'll save it, and, uh, we will end it here. So. I am Ultima Mantoid, and this is Let's Play Earthbound. Till next time, take care, and have fun.